Oh my god, guys, I'm back to YouTube when I have camera. Oh my god, I'm so excited. <coughs> So basically I need to figure out fast how this fucking flash works on this camera because it gets dark at like 6 o'clock now and I have no idea how to do it. I'm gonna figure that out, trust me. But anyways, we are doing a three part vlog for my birthday series because I was gonna do one vlog and join it all together because my birthday celebrations really start this weekend because my boyfriend is taking me away on Sunday night to somewhere which I actually guessed exactly where we're going on the first go because I'm amazing. I'm a genius, what can I say? But I think we're going to Ross Harbour and I'm off work on Monday so I'm vlogging all of that but that's gonna be a separate vlog. This is just the getting ready for the first round of birthday celebrations and then next weekend is my actual birthday celebrations where I'm having a big party, all the girls are coming over, like I have the decorations all ordered and all of them have arrived to be fair bar these pink and white straws and it's really grinding on me and I don't know why but yeah I'm waiting for them to be delivered but other than that my birthday stuff is a go. The birthday dress I do have ordered but it hasn't arrived yet. It's from Mango but I have got my boots and wait till you see these boots guys. Oh my god. My hair is getting done at like 12 o'clock on the Saturday of my birthday. My birthday is actually not till the Sunday but we're just gonna say it's on the Saturday because my party's on the Saturday. But I've got my makeup booked at 12 and my hair booked at 1 that day. And I don't want to have like hair and makeup all glam, then like an over the top dress and then have these boots because the boots are quite a statement. So I thought we'd just go cash with the dress and then party in the boots, you know? Yeah, I'm gonna go into town to get earrings. I'm gonna go to Superdrug and get loads of random shit like face masks. Because I feel in the mood to just revive. I just wear these Zara flares. I got them for like 10 euro in Dublin last Christmas and they're the best things ever especially when I have tan on because they're not like clinging to my sticky ass legs but yeah I think we might get like a tie I also feel like I need to talk you through the creative process for this picture wall yes I am my own biggest fan anyways this whole wall you can see right here honey actually it's just me in frame because I'm literally looking at myself sorry guys I'm taking these pictures down and unfortunately that is drilled into the wall so we can't do anything about that we're gonna have to just put the balloon arch above it so the balloon arch is gonna go from there all around there and probably come down this side that chair is going to be removed from the equation of and this table is going to be pushed to the left so that's going to just be the table's just going to have drinks so we're not going to worry about that but then when we're over here that means that that's going to leave so much space for like photo ops over there with all the gals which i'm so excited for because the balloons i have say happy birthday danielle so i don't want it to look like plastic balloon overload because i don't want it to be tacky it's not me and Anna Skillen with the camera. But you know, we're just gonna roll with it. I'm going into a Ryla Nice. Oh my god, I don't know what ones to go for. They have like, I feel like I need silver ones, but all of these are gold. We could do like these, but I don't know. Oh my god. I don't want to get gold or to get silver because the boots are obviously in between, but like, this is the new Luxula jewelry section. There was nice earrings in River Island, but none that like I love. I actually might just get like these, you know. I think they're kind of cute. So we are on the way to get the tie. I'm so excited. I went to Superdrug and I got some skincare stuff. But that mean two face masks and a body scrub. So I am walking to the Thai takeaway now to collect a spicy bag. And Guys, got the spice bag and we got back this from Thai Kitchen. Look how amazing it looks. Although to be fair, like their curry sauce isn't great. So Fully walked into the Chinese and just asked for a portion of curry sauce. But we're gonna plate it up. I'm so excited. Sorry, why does this look awful on please? It slaps. Anyways, I went to sleep a drug. I don't look like Bella Hadid after putting these on my eyelids for under my eyelids for 10 minutes. I'm suing. Anyways, next up is this scrub. I swear, this is the Pomegranate Saints. It smells unbelievable. I literally am obsessed with this. And when I got this for the first time like six months ago, then I went back the second time to try and get it and it was out of stock. I went in today and it was in stock. Imagine I was going on about Ross Harbour and I turned around and my boyfriend wasn't even taking me to Ross Harbour. It was somewhere else, somewhere else like completely random. Although I'm pretty sure it's Ross Harbour. Anyways, then I also got earrings. Now, the earrings are not as big a statement earring as I thought I was gonna go for. They're actually like really basic and I got them in new luck. There, they're in focus now. Yeah, I I might order another pair online. I don't know. Although another cause of concern is the fact that I pierced my own ears. So look how low 
I pierced right over my left hand side. The right one's fine, but the left one is tragic. I keep thinking that when I put in a heavy earring, it's just gonna drag through my ear. But I mean, we'll deal with that when we come to it. So yeah. I'm okay guys, someone else have these bits of hair that like, when you wash them, I don't know what this is from, but they'll literally come down and it's just giving berries and cream. Like they flow down like that. I don't know why it does that. Is it because I run my hands through my hair like that? Oh for God's sake, I've accidentally put two on one eye. Okay, guys, next we're gonna do some skincare. Am I the only person like, I'm like, oh my god, I can't wait to have a self care night and then the second, I like sit still for two seconds, I'm like, no, fuck this. So yeah, these are coming off. Wiping that off. I love it when my skin is like dripping in La Roche Posay. Like, that's what I love. Sorry, also in them ads that I did for La Roche Posay, everyone was commenting on it saying, oh my god, she calls it La Roche Posay. <laughs> Lol. This is the Evaclar. I see people on TikTok be like, this is amazing. To be honest, I don't think I've used this before, but I know it's a scrub, so. Oh yeah, half of my hair is getting in this and I literally just washed my hair today. So next up, Clarion Ultra 8. Anyways, I just follow this routine because it was on the brief when I had to do the videos. So, I mean, if they wanted it in that order for their videos, then surely that's correct skin routine. But like before I did them videos, I didn't have skincare routine. I think I just washed my face with tap water. Like once a week. No cap. I actually don't even know what no cap means. But I see it all the time in life. No cap, dude. Like I actually don't know what it means. And then I like to go in with, yeah, I go in with a little eye cream. Tularian Dermalego eye cream. Still fully using my flash on my phone to give this like okay lighting because I literally don't even think the flash works when videoing on a Canon G7. Maybe I'm just an idiot. Anyways, lastly, we're going in with this. This is the Holy Grail, the Godsend. It's the Tellarian. Can you even see that? Is that in focus? Rosh Pesay to Tellarian Dermal Night Cream. But it's like a full on gel. Oh my god. It feels amazing. Going on, like I literally do this every night. I don't. I just like want to look if I can be arsed. It is Friday. And it's. 9pm and I'm kind of getting tempted to make myself a little gin and talk while I watch an episode of Grey's Anatomy. Does that sound like fun? I think that does sound like fun. If I would ever be in focus. Okay, I fully have no idea what just happened to my camera there, but I just had to press like a billion buttons. Oh my god, also I forgot to show you my celebrations. I'm obviously not cracking this open now. I'm going to save that for my birthday. I certainly did not buy this. I don't know which one of my friends brought this over, but I am going to be taking full advantage. I hope I have lemons. Anyways, I was gonna have this gin. Can't find any tonic water. I only have soda water, which is really random. So I'm going to have instead a ready made gin tin. These are the best goddamn things invented, honestly. I love them. I'm actually really not a pink gin fan, which is really weird, you know. But then again, I don't even know if I'm a gin and slim girl. I think I'm a vodka soda lime girl. That's my favorite drink. And yeah, after this, I am gonna watch Grey's Anatomy. I literally started watching Grey's Anatomy I would say about three weeks ago. I am now on season seven, episode 16, I think. But yeah, that is my crazy Friday night antics, I suppose. So yeah, guys, now I'm gonna watch some Grey's Anatomy. It's actually terrifying though. I have my gin and tonic here still, but it's actually terrifying to me because I actually have a friend who's a doctor who's the exact same age as me. But yeah, that is probably the end of my vlog. For the get ready with me. Did I even accomplish anything other than wearing eye patches for like 10 minutes and putting some serums on my face and then stuffing my face with a tie? No, but I enjoyed it and I hope you did and I'll see you in two days.